When a component is larger than the measuring volume of the device, several device positions may be required to complete the inspection. CAM2 Measure 10 has a Move Device Wizard to simplify and guide the users through the process. The wizard offers two methods, automatic or manual. This video will instruct on the manual method. A move device can be executed with or without a coordinate system or alignment. In this example, we have aligned to the CAD model just to help visualize the move device. First we have to measure a minimum of three point reducible features towards the limits of our measurement range. The features should create as big a triangle as possible to ensure the best relocation result. Here we shall measure two circles. and one point. If using attachments to create reference points, it is essential that the features used are firmly fixed or are a physical part of the component. From the Measure tab, select Circle and probe the circle on the top face. Now select Plane and probe the side face. Again select circle and measure the side circle. And finally select point and probe in the small machined hole. Now from the devices tab. Select Move Device from the ribbon. The Move Device Wizard will open. Select the device you wish to move from the pull down. Then select the method, in this case manual. Now select Next to proceed. In the left hand pane, highlight the features to use for the Move Device. Use the arrows to move the selection into the right hand pane. Select Next. Now move the device to the new position, ensuring that you can reach all the chosen features. Select Next. Now remeasure the features as prompted, including the planes for the circles. Once features are measured, the result window displays a green circle next to them. The move device error incurred by the move is also displayed. Click Finish to accept and complete the move device. Click Previous to step back and repeat the measurements. The device has been relocated and the screen displays both device positions. The active device position has a disk around the sphere. We can continue to measure within the original alignment or coordinate system. Should additional device moves be required, simply follow the same steps and create new reference features or use the existing. That concludes this video. Thanks for watching.